Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. Before I begin, I would like to say thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, subscribed, and who has donated to this channel. Um, I would also like to thank everyone who has purchased a reading with me. This is for the sign of Cancer for the first half of November, or from the time you view this video. It is a general reading, uh, so the messages will only be for a specific few who are watching. So let's begin. I feel, Cancer, that uh, there was a relationship. Uh, this is talking about a past love that it's like you just couldn't get over. Um, you're unable to like move forward um, to bring, uh, like you feel like your life is out of balance. I feel that you would like to um, to revive this relationship um, and to confess your love to this person. You seem to be undecided how you're going to do this. Um, it's like here we see you wanting to revive something that died, okay? But um, this is a card of finding a solution, but then we have the hermit in reverse who's blind. So it's like you don't see your way to be able to find the solution here at the present moment. I feel like you are lonely and you miss this person and you fantasize about them. You are unhappy uh, with your present situation. Um, feeling again, we have this card that would speak to being uh, out of balance and you're trying to think of a way uh, to obtain that desired result. This is a card of sacrifice, so perhaps for someone it you would have to sacrifice something, perhaps one relationship for another. Because this woman, she appears to have everything. She's sitting in this garden of abundance, but she's not happy. She's not happy with herself. She's not happy with her life. And she's taking a long, hard look at herself and at her situation. In the past, um, this was some sort of committed relationship. Uh, you could have been living together or um, married even. And that came to an end because of uh, unfaithfulness here or some sort of lies, de deceit. But I, I feel more unfaithfulness. You may have received or will receive um some news and this could come by way of uh, a friend uh, it could be even on social media that gives you some type of uh, hope that you can indeed revive this relationship and you are thinking of taking this leap of faith But there are obstacles here still, we see, because we do have this card. Um, uh, this is a card of burdens, and this person is carrying burden on their back, and it comes with the moon. So there still could be just, it could just simply be a lot of things that are, are left, like they're sitting in the unknown that you don't know yet, because you're just going here by blind faith by some sort of uh, message that you received. So you don't, you don't have all of the answers. But there is a change that will come to that because you have the wheel in the upright here. So this situation here of burdens, of not having the answers, is about to change for you. So that's basically it. <laughs> There's not much more I can say than that. So that that is um, good news um, for you. 
So I feel like there is like uh, a destined uh, turn of events here that, you know, um, it had to happen in divine timing and um, not so much, you know, uh, in, in when you wanted it to happen. This is divine timing. This is a fated event. Uh, this news that you did receive, it, it, it's like all part of a higher uh, order. And was meant to come in at this time, this period here. So I thank you so much for watching. I wish you all the best and many blessings. Bye for now.